37 lightning caused fires have been found across the Umpqua National Forest after four additional ones were discovered over the weekend. Thank you for joining us. I'm Jillian Smuckler. KZI 9 News reporter Emma Withrow spoke with officials today to see how they're preparing for the rest of fire season. And she joins us live in the studio with our fire watch coverage tonight. And Emma, how are they working to make sure more fires don't spark up? Jillian, officials at the Umpqua National Forest Service told me that they are taking these lightning strikes very seriously and always preparing for storms. With 37 confirmed fires and 40 smoke reports throughout the area, fire crews are working tirelessly to catch these strikes before significant damage is done. Officials tell me many of the confirmed fires are controlled and are in patrol status, while others are being actively fought by firefighters. Officials say firefighters are working to get access to several smoke reports from deep within the forest where access is limited and difficult terrain makes travel more complicated. It's, it's always nice when the lightning is predicted. Like I said, we can prepare, but I do want to say that the firefighters have done just an outstanding job with really aggressive initial attack. They're able to keep all our fires under an acre. So for 35 fires under an acre, that's pretty good. We're really proud of them. Firefighters are working to access other smoke reports from limited access areas within the forest. Officials at Umpqua National Forest say that the public should look out for fire trucks blocking off certain roads in order to contain any fires that could break out from lightning strikes. With a plethora of resources being put towards keeping these fires at bay, officials at the Umpqua Forest feel prepared for whatever comes next. Reporting live in the studio, I'm Emma Withrow, KEZI 9 News.